Hi everybody, Dr. Thomas Wu with my trusty Yamaha tuba. We've got another way to help you learn to play in tune, this time using scale fragments. Let me show you what I mean. So, I've got my Yamaha Harmony Director setting up a drone, root, fifth, upper root, and I'm trying to play in tune with that. Obviously, thus far, I'm just using the first five degrees of the scale, up to the fifth, back down to the root. Doing that a couple times because as I finish the scale, I want to target that note. So, I've got the drone from the Harmony Director showing me where I want to be. That becomes my ear target. I assure you, professional players and singers do this. They know where they want to land, not necessarily, you know, every step along the way. So I'm practicing what I call ear targets to be in tune with the drone. The Harmony Director is awesome, but there's lots of other free online programs that will allow you to set up a drone and then just tune intervals against it. If you can set up the root and the fifth, that's even better. Again, thank you, Harmony Director. But even if you just have the root, Play the fifth in tune, right? The whole point is to build our ears. Matching pitch is great, but anticipating the pitch equally valuable. So now I'm going to turn the drone back on and explore a little bit more in those same scale patterns, again, with the goal of being perfectly in tune. slightest bit to make it play in tune. Great. That's the point. That's the whole point of this exercise is, you know, as I'm finishing these scale patterns, what's my target? Where do I want to be? Now again, Yamaha is a great horn. It makes it really easy to find those notes. Thank you, Yamaha. But I still have to listen and adjust. Okay? So that was key about. That's a really friendly key. Let's move around to some other keys just to check it out. Um, how about good old E flat? adjustment, right? Um, and by the way, all this presumes that you tuned your instrument at some point. Keep an eye on the YouTube channel. I've got two or three videos on that that I'll post really soon. You can check that out. Um, so again, back to key B flat. Now I'm going to explore. You heard me play those, you know, one to five scale patterns targeting the root and the fifth. Now I'll take it up to the octave and we'll see where we're at.
branch out into some other keys. I think as as band people, we tend to get stuck in the most familiar keys, you know, B flat, F, E flat. Let's move to say G and see where that's at. Same pattern, just one to five to start. adjustment. The whole point is those adjustments, okay? Great players adjust quickly. Again, the, the goal of this exercise, we could call this exercise target note intonation, right? I know where I want to be because I'm hearing it from the drone, I'm trying to match that. If it's not perfect, I'm going to make some adjustments. Now I'm going to do it again, and the goal is to find that top note quicker, right? Great players make really fast adjustments. Okay? If any adjustment is needed at all, ideally your target, you know, your ear is already anticipating where to go and you just put it there. And this is how you learn how to do that. So, same thing, key of G. Thanks so much. Catch you later.